So we got the we got the encyclopedia idea. So what else? Who else has an, an idea of, of advertising? Because you can't just do one idea and just say and then expect everybody to be like, hey, yeah, let's do that. Because you, you know, you know, the car commercials they have print ads. They have they have uh, commercials. They have radio commercials. I got it. Little grassroots multi-level marketing. You know, kind of like a pyramid scheme. Like basically, like. You know, I'd start my chain, and I'd have to get, you know, people under me to promote scabs. And then people under them would promote scabs, and people under them would promote scabs. And then that way, we can build a whole pyramid of... And they would get makeup. But you only have eight friends, so... Yeah, but my eight friends may have eight friends. And eight times eight is a lot. Oh, okay. But but how do we, how do we actually get the... Uh, get them to advertise because doing the whole you know pyramid scheme thing works but if you just like watch skevs tell your friends and that might work but i think we need to be a little more um aggressive with with our advertising like <gasps> aggressive yes betty white is all the rage right now because of that snickers commercial where she tackled people or got tackled i don't remember i didn't watch the super bowl but we can just go around town as people are enjoying a nice, you know, cookie or sandwich and just tackle them and say, watch Skeds, boom! I got it, I got it. Um, just let's, let's step it up. Okay, in medieval times, like, the way they would carry messages is they would tie them to arrows and they'd shoot the arrow and then the, the next archer would grab it and shoot it and, and the next, and they get the, it's like speed map. What if we... Right, watch Skevs on arrow, then we shoot it at people. And, the, oh, what's that? Oh, oh, Skevs. Like, this is great. I don't really think Their last dying words. Good marketing, though. That might make people hate us. No, no, no. What's what? Oh, oh, Uncle Frank. It's hard to hear about Uncle Frank. What was his last words? He said to watch Skevs. His yeah. last dying wish was to watch Skevs. We're touching the hearts of Americans. Like, literally, probably with the arrow, could touch their heart. Well, arrows are a little outdated. We might should consider stepping it up to the 20th century. At least the not, 20th. I'm not following you. Like, like cannons? Or... or yeah, because 1901 is 1999. What are we talking here? What, what, what about, what about, um, what about... We, you, know, you know how they have those things where they just like shoot the cannon or the mortar or whatever and it just like starts dripping flyers everywhere? Shrapnel! Yeah. But, but we're not actually hitting people then. We we need to hit people. Well, we can we can we can take the flyers and, and put them in their mailboxes. No, shrap sh shrapnel is not a good idea because the message is gonna like oh s you know like little bits of the message. Yeah. yeah. Flyers. Good jigsaw puzzle. I like the idea of flyers though. People um, like jigsaw puzzles. Well, we could we could put them in we could put them in their mailboxes. And most or, people have mailboxes. Yeah. Well, that's a federal offense to put uh, a flyer or anything that's not postage of the USPS. Oh, uh, yeah, that, does, that costs a lot of money. That's illegal. And, yes, I'm not about to break the law for this uh, production. I'm sorry. 